They treat me um, as if I'm some kind of crazy person, uh, or like I have three horns coming out of my head. But what they don't understand is they're the ones that are crazy and they're the ones that are so disconnected. You make them scared, you make them victims, and you change their mindset. And then possibly you can pass anti-gun legislation. Is that what happened in Las Vegas? The average leftist, I agree with you, actually does think you've got five heads or I've got six heads. And now you guys use your COVID hoax to like set a checkpoint up so you can take over the parts and start charging? It's unconstitutional. Her reservation is that we live in a free country. We live in America. Also, let's bear in mind, maybe he doesn't have as much influence as he used to because he's just like talking to people who don't even care that he's talking to them. Like how diminished is Alex Jones. They're not interested. I think they're really scared of the American people because here's what they do know. They know that if the American people actually woke up from the dream that they're living in, uh, the so-called American dream where it's it's more like entertainment at like Roman games or something like that. The left is scared of uh, the American people and that if only they would wake up. You know, like if they'd become woke or something like that. That's an interesting little slip up there. But also, uh, we're scared of the American people. The Republican Party has won one popular vote in a presidential election in basically three decades now at this point. If anyone is afraid of the American people's effect writ large over our politics, it is gonna be you guys. The look in her eyes, that, that intonation of, I'm smarter than you. And because of space lasers, and this crazy can and it's and it's because it's a show and they say that on the forums this is the best show i've ever seen cuz dude get netflix get disney plus go watch some disney movies those are they've got some good shows on there you don't need to bring that to the halls of congress and they talk about false flags all the time but the only false flag operation going on is that she pretends she cares about the united states she doesn't she cares about being cool on QAnon conspiracy theory message boards. That's it. If she really cared, she'd do her research. She's a congresswoman. But it, it's, yeah. it makes her feel so good and so important to, to feel like she's got that edge by asking questions. I love when they have rhetorical questions that actually have answers.